So I was a family physician uh, in the 1980s, working in an Aboriginal community outside Montreal in Canada. And myself and uh, colleagues felt that we were seeing a lot of people who had type 2 diabetes. So we were interested to know if this in fact was true. We had uh, community members and we got permission from the local hospital to undertake a chart review. And then we documented, yes, high rates of type 2 diabetes, so twice the national average. Uh, we set out to share these results with the community because we wanted uh, this to be research that was of value to help community make health decisions um, at an individual level, at a family level, a community level. And we made uh, about 15 community presentations um, over a couple of months telling people about uh, what we had found. So the exciting thing was that community members, the elders, came to us afterwards and asked us to do something to prevent future generations from becoming uh, diabetic. And we started in partnership with the community, led by the community health promotion uh, project, uh, which has resulted in uh, the rates of diabetes remaining stable over the last 20 years, which is a major outcome because rates of type two diabetes are just going steadily upwards uh, across the whole of North America.